Hello YouTube family, welcome back. Let's provide a solution given this nice exponential equation which is 20 raised to the power x plus 20 raised to the power x plus 20 raised to the power x divided by 10 raised to the power x plus 10 raised to the power x. This is equal to 100. So what is the value of x? Solution. Now from here, we have that 20 raised to the power x plus 20 raised to the power x plus 20 raised to the power x. In that case, 20 raised to the power x is common. So we factor out 10, 20 raised to the power x so that we'll have 1 plus 1 plus 1 divided by 10 raised to the power x. It's common again. So you will have 1 plus 1. This is equal to 100. Okay? So this is 1 plus 1 plus 1, so you'll have 20 raised to the power x multiplied by 3 divided by 10 raised to the power x multiplied by 2. This is equal to 100. Okay? So we multiply both signs by 2 over 3. Multiply both signs by 2 over 3 so that we simplify this. Okay? So that you'll have 20 raised to the power x divided by 10 raised to the power x. This is equal to 200 divided by 3. Okay? Now from here, from here, we find that given that if you have a raised to the power n divided by b raised to the power n, the exponent are the same we can have a divided by b raised to the power n, okay? So let's express this in that way. We'll have 20 divided by 10 raised to the power x. This is equal to 200 divided by 3, okay? So if you simplify here, we're going to have 2 raised to the power x. This is equal to 200 divided by 3. So to solve for the value of x, we introduce the natural logarithm as follows. So we have 2 raised to the power x is equal to 200 divided by 3. So introduce the natural logarithm. We'll have log 2 raised to the power x. This is equal to log 200 divided by 3. Okay. Now from here, we apply the power rule property of logarithm. That is, if you have log m raised to the power n, so we have that rock 2 raised to the power x is in this form, which is in the form of rock m raised to the power n, which we can express as n rock m, okay? So let's apply this property. Let's apply this property so that you're going to have x rock 2. This is equal to rock 200 divided by 3, okay? Now from here, rog 200 divided by 3, this is in the form of rog a divided by b, which we can express as rog a subtract rog rog b. So let's apply this property. Let's apply this property so that we'll have x rog 2, this is equal to rog 200 subtract rog 3, okay? Now, as you can see, we divide both signs by rock 2. They divide both signs by rock 2. Okay. And 200, this 200 can be expressed as 25 times 8. Okay. 25 times 8. Okay. Of which 8 can also be simplified further to be 2 raised to the power 3. So let's let's substitute this. So if you simplify that, we'll have x is equal to rog 25 times 8, which we can write as 2 raised to power 3, okay, divided by rog 2, subtract rog 3, divided by rog 2, okay? Now from here, so we have x is equal to rog 25 
times 2 raised to the power 3 divided by rock 2 subtract row 3 divided by rock 2 now rock 25 times 2 raised to the power 3 is in the form of rock a multiplied by b of which we can express as rock a plus rock b okay so let's write that we'll have rock 25 divided by rock 2 plus now we can write this as 3 rock 2 divided by rock 2 subtract rock 3 divided by rock 2 okay now from here we simplify this okay so that we're going to have x is equal to rock 25 divided by rock 2 plus 3 subtract rog 3 divided by rog 2 okay now as you can see rog 25 divided by rog 2 and rog 3 divided by rog 2 this is in the form of rog a divided by rog b which we can write as rog a to base b so let's write this in this format so that x x is equal to 3 okay plus rog 25 to base 2 okay subtract rog 3 to base 2 okay so that's the value of x okay so we have that the value of x is equal to 3 plus rog 25 to base 2 minus rog 3 to base 2 so let's verify if this value of x satisfies the equation okay as you may recall we have that 2 raised to the power x this is equal to 200 divided by 3 okay so let's verify that 2 raised to the power x is equal to 200 over 3 let's substitute the value of x we will have 2 raised to the power 3 plus rog 25 to base 2 subtract rog 3 to base 2 this is supposed to give us a value of 200 divided by 3 okay now from here rog 3 plus rog 25 to base 2 subtract rog 3 to base 2 this is in the form of a raised to the power n minus m which we can write as a raised to the power n divided by a raised power m so let's transform in this using this property we'll have 2 raised to power 3 multiplied by 2 raised to power rog 25 to base 2 okay divided by 2 raised to power rog 3 to base 2 this is supposed to give us 200 divided by 3 okay so we have that 2 raised to power rock 25 to base 2 and 2 raised to power rock 3 to base 2. This is in the form of m raised to power rock a to base m, which we can express as a. Okay. So if you have rock that is 2 raised to power rock 25 to base 2, this essentially is supposed to give us a value of 25. Okay. The same case to 2 raised to power rock. 3 to base 2, this is equal to 3. Let's substitute these values, okay? So that we're going to have 2 raised to power 3 multiplied by 25 divided by 2 raised to power of 3 to base 2, which is 3. This is supposed to give us a value of 200 divided by 3, okay? So here, 2 raised to power 3 this is 8 multiplied by 25 divided by 3. This is equal to 200 divided by 3. Okay. So it's true that we have 200 divided by 3, which is equal to 200 divided by 3. Okay. So that means that the left hand side is equal to the right hand side. Okay. And that affirms that the value of x which is equal to 3 plus rog 25 to base 2 
subtract from 3 to base 2 satisfies the equation okay so thank you for watching and kindly subscribe kindly subscribe